The experience for me was very emotional. It was just really powerful. It was so much more than I expected. Well, it started as an initiative in correlation with events that had already been programmed at the UBC Vancouver campus, as well as the Truth and Reconciliation National event in Vancouver. We wanted to provide the students here at UBC's Okanagan campus the opportunity to partake in that programming and actually experience it similar to the opportunities that their colleagues and peers in Vancouver would have. We took a group of 28 students to the Truth and Reconciliation Commission national event in Vancouver. We also used the bus trip on the way down to Vancouver as an opportunity for myself and Professor Margot Tamez to speak to the students and prepare them a bit for what they were going to see. I had a pretty good idea that it was going to have a powerful impact on the students. I'm an intergenerational survivor myself. My mom attended the residential schools for 11 years. It brought back a lot of memories, I guess, for my own sake, kind of back to my roots, back to my history. A lot of students, when they went down there, you kind of have a preconceived notion of the emotions you might feel or what to expect, and I think everybody kind of walked away with things that they didn't expect they would feel, and knowing more about individuals and about the stories and experiences than they wouldn't necessarily learn from a textbook or learn from a documentary. It really bound us together as a group and we were so vulnerable, we had to break down our walls between us because it was such an emotional experience, you know, it wasn't like a typical field trip. Being in it hands-on and seeing it face-to-face -face and hearing it and being in the presence of somebody who's telling their story and maybe telling their story for the first time, it's nothing like it. You can't get that out of a book. This five-year mandate that is going on is a one-time opportunity for students to get out of the classroom, off the campus, and experience deep learning. I think a lot of what goes on in the classroom is surface learning, and what went on for the students who went to Vancouver was deep learning.